Question 10. Tick the two numbers which have a total of 10. Now the problem you've got here is you could tick any two of these six numbers, but there's only one combination which will actually give you a total of 10. The biggest advice I can give you is whichever two you tick, check with a column method, an addition column method, that it actually adds up to 10. Too many people tick two numbers and then just move on, assuming that they've got the answer correct when actually they've got it incorrect. And a quick check would have told them that they've got it incorrect. So let's actually do a wrong answer to illustrate how we would perform the check. So if you think these two are the two that make 10, this is wrong by the way, but this is how you would check it. So one plus nine is 10, put your zero in, carry your one. Zero plus zero plus one is one. Don't forget your decimal point. 0 plus 9 is 9. So actually these two added together give us 9.10, which is not a total of 10, so it can't be these two. Back to the drawing board. Let's do another wrong answer. Let's say you think it's these two. 1 plus 0, 1, add 9 plus 9, 9. 1 plus 9 is 10, carry the 1. 0 plus 9 plus 1 is 10 again, carry the 1. 1 plus 9 is 10, Plus that extra one of the count is actually 11. So, and put your decimal points in. So, actually, these two make 11. Now, we could go on all day picking any combination of two numbers and check and see if it makes 10. But at this point, we could just think a little bit. We could say, well, actually, this is 99 hundredths and this is 100. And 99 hundredths plus 100 gives us a whole one and that whole one on top of this nine whole ones will make ten so it looks like it should be this one and this one but again we should never just tick them we should just double check with a color method so 9.99 add 0 0.01 quick check one plus nine is ten Put your zero in, carry your one. Zero plus nine is nine, plus that one is ten. So put your zero in again, carry your one. Nine plus zero plus the one I've carried is ten. Now don't forget we need a decimal point in there, so we've got ten point zero zero. Ten point zero zero is ten. These two things are the same thing. So we found it. So those two numbers that we've ticked do indeed have a total of 10. But always check with the column method.